Hey kids, we are at the bee exhibit at the Above and Beyond Children's Museum. I'm so excited to do a bee themed class today for you guys. So we are going to get in our mindful space, blow our mindful bubbles so we have lots of room to move mindfully and we stay safe and happy. All right, so stick your feet in the ground, breathing in, reaching your arms up, breathing out, reaching your arms, stretching your fingers, breathing in, breathing out, breathing in, breathing out. Be mindful of the people, the things around you. We're paying attention on purpose with kindness to the things and people and animals around us. So let's go ahead and shift a little bit if you need more room and then we'll do our washing out or our washing machine. Breathing in, let your arms flap. We're out, breathing in, breathing out. Let them flap, let them flap, let them flap, let them flap. Let them flap and back to the middle. Bubble blowing breath. Pretend you have bubbles. Ready, big, slow exhales, breathing out. Use your imagination. Imagine you can even pick a color that you might think your bubble is. exercise is called the buzzing bee breath. So this one is going to make some noise a little bit. So we can pay attention on purpose to how it feels, how our tongue feels when we do it, what it sounds like. So it's going to be a deep breath in and then make that bee buzzing noise. All right, let's try it together. Deep breath in. heart see if you can feel and notice your body vibrate when you buzz breathe in Notice what you feel like right now. I feel calm and happy. The balance pose we're going to do with our B exhibit is the tree pose. We've got this super cool tree behind us that the bees might go to their flowers and get some of the pollen and other flowers in the garden. So we're going to practice the tree pose. So one of our things we need to remember is that we want to keep our eyes on something. Pick something in front of you that you can look at. So I can actually look forward and I might even look at this really cool design that's behind me. There's a, usually you want something that's right in front of your face so you don't have to look too far up or too far down. Okay, so I'm gonna plant my feet like I'm planting a tree really super, super strong. I'm gonna find my spot. I'm gonna look at or my object. And then we can start with just balancing with our toe, other toe on the ground. We're gonna balance on one foot. And then we might bring our hands to our heart like this, or our hands out in front. Like maybe we're waiting for a bee to land on our hand or a butterfly. And if that, if you wanna try another way, you can put your other foot on your balancing foot. You might feel your foot wiggle a little bit. Take a deep breath. And let's try the other side. All right, so notice, pay attention on purpose, feel your 
foot, like you're planting it into the ground, like you have roots, like your toes are roots. And keep your toe on the ground if you need to, or bring your foot on your other ankle. Bring your hands to your heart, or your hands out front. Keep your eyes on your spot. Take a few deep breaths. fall over, if your tree falls over, take a deep breath. Just keep trying. Let's try it one more time on each foot. Feel your foot planted into the ground. Use your toes like roots. And reach your, your tree super high to the sky. Make yourself really tall. Take some deep breaths. Imagine like you're smelling the beautiful flowers around. And try your other side. Notice your feet might start to get a little, little sore. That means your muscles are working and they're going to get stronger. Both feet back to the ground. Take a deep breath. Breathe out. Our strength and energy exercise is going to be like how the bees fly to go from flower to flower. So this is the bee exhibit at the museum and they don't have their real bees here yet, but they're going to come in the summer, which is super exciting. So one of the really cool facts that they say is that a bee can fly up to six miles and as fast as 15 miles per hour. That is super amazing, thinking about how small a bee is. So we're gonna pretend like we are the bees flying around. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna flap our arms really, really strongly, just like the strength of the bee's wings. All right, here we go. So what we're gonna do is, is start to flap our wings and then we're gonna also pretend like we're we're reaching up to the sky really tall, like we're gonna go to a flower or a tree there and then we're gonna go down and keep flapping our wings like we're gonna fly to a flower that's lower. All right, ready? Here we go. Like you're going up really tall. Maybe you make them really big, really big. Flap them hard, flap them strong, and then sink them back down. Go down to a flower down below, and then back up, and then maybe go turn around and flap. Stay in your mindful space. Flap, 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 flap. Up high, up high. Down low, down low, down low, down low, down low. Keep going, almost there. And imagine you've landed on the flower that you want to be on. Woo. Notice your heart rate. For our coordination and our fun exercise, we are going to do the waggle dance. Did you know that bees can talk to each other by dancing? It's pretty amazing. So we're going to have some fun and, and get some wiggles out and we're going to do our own waggle dance. So let's try. First, you're just going to wiggle your, wiggle your bottom back and forth, wiggle your bottom back and forth, and then turn around, stay in your mindful position. Wiggle in, wiggle, 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 wiggle. All right, and now see if you can waggle and wiggle on one foot and one arm. So this foot stays on the ground. This arm waggle wiggles, waggle wiggle wiggle wiggle. Woo! Waggle wiggle 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 wiggle. Try the other side. This foot, this arm. Wiggle 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 wiggle. Wiggle 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 wiggle. Go back and forth. And then just wiggle all around, wiggle, 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 wiggle. Whew. All right. Keep going if you want to keep going and try again. 
It's time for the thankful tapping song near the bee exhibit with, amongst this beautiful artwork. I love art and I love nature and all the beautiful things in our lives so we can be grateful for those things as well. All right, we're gonna do our thankful tapping song. Tap on your brain, in your head. I am thankful for my brain. I am thankful for my brain. Tap on your heart to your chest. I am thankful for my heart. I am thankful for my heart. And I'm thankful for my body and all of its parts. I'm thankful for my friends, for their eyes and their smiles. But now it's time for learning for a little while. Get back in your mindful position, your sitting position or your standing position. Take three buzzing bee breaths. Thankful for you.